I'm back again with another video, another car, another review. You know who it is, you know what it is. I'm JB and this is The Car Show. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, hit that share button. If you've been here, then you know, like I said, you know what it is. You know what's going on, you know the vibes. But right here, I'm at Elder Hyundai in Sterling Heights, Michigan. I got this 2022 Genesis GV70. It's still in shit mode right now, just fresh off the truck, but we still gonna do this review little walk around interior review see see what's going on with it but let's get straight to it right off the back baby you know how i start my videos off headlight design you see the, the led headlights led turn center led brights of course it's quiet i like these would be your brights right here and these would be the headlights and that of course would be a turn center right there genesis you know you know it's a genesis when the headlights look like that but coming down down right here no fog lights but it is airflow going into the vent of course right there you got a parking sensor right here but this this front end is just gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. It reminds me of a Bentley Bentayga. Call me crazy. But you got a gloss black trim across coming at the bottom of the grill. Airflow going in, of course, right there. The vents right here. You got a 360 camera. Black trim, gloss black trim right there. But it is, I want to call that a bronze, monkey brass. Brass right there going across the grill right here. I love that touch, just like that Kia Stinger. I'm starting to see, I guess I'm starting to see that a lot more than I pay attention, but this front end is just huge, like gorgeous. Like, just look at it. But as we come on to the driver's side, but you see the headlights, they wrap around coming towards the driver's side, of course, but let's get down here to these 20 inch wheels. These, I'm gonna call these space gray wheels. You got a Genesis brake caliber, of course. Look at this design, like, I don't even know how to describe that. Well, how about, I'm gonna call that like a golf ball, a golf ball design on the uh, on the wheel right there. That is, that's that's new. That's it's not new, but it's like new to me. New to me. It's better than the GV80. I believe that is optional, but that's that's perfect. You can't get no better than that on the Genesis. But coming on to the door, you got a black trim at the bottom. At the bottom, you know me. You know I love black. Let's come on up to this mirror though. You got a mirror right here. If mirrors fold in automatically once you lock the door. It is an LED turn signal. It is a black trim right there. The turn signal on the, it's not on the side like my last video, how the GV80 uh, had it on the side. It is on the mirror this time right here. Coming on to the door, that, they got that brass, that monkey, we're gonna call that monkey brass. I'm calling that monkey brass. Monkey brass right there. Monkey brass on the uh, trim of the window, of course, right there. If you wonder why I'm calling it monkey brass, Dodge have some wheels that are that color and they call those monkey brass and that's that's just off the color that i know but that monkey brass comes across right here all the way to the back baby all the way to the back same thing with the wheel back here these wheel these rims are gorgeous gorgeous like oh my god coming on to the back the rear end of the car you see the tail lights the dual quad whatever you want to call it quad twat tail lights those are led blinkers what a reverse light that? Let's find that reverse light. I think a reverse light is in there, but look at these exhausts. Like, look how big that exhaust is. GV70, of course. Genesis, of course. All wheel drive 3.T. Come on now. Come on now. It is a spoiler right there. This is your brake light going right here, of course. Brake light right there. This is a spoiler. You got your shark tail up there. You want to open the trunk. That is how you open the trunk. Hit that button, open the trunk. And you hit that button, press it right back up. Push, don't pull, baby. Push, don't pull. Interior-wise of the car, oh my God, look at this. this. This caught my eye instantly. I don't even know what the car this design right here. It reminds me of the wheels, like how the wheels look. But look at that stitch rack, of course, right there on the door panel. Premium speakers, Lexicon. I knew you had to look. I remember. What is it? Is it Lexicon? Lexicon. Yup. Lexicon speakers right there. Let's see. Fold. You can fold your mirrors in. It is a button right there. Fold your mirrors in. Boom. Keep them folded in right there. You got your uh, window uh, control right there, of course. Memory setting seats right there. Then coming on the interior of the car, Genesis right there. Aluminum, not illuminated, baby. Genesis on the carpet right there. To move that seat back. Oh, Alcatara. <sighs> Alcatara on the car. Let's get in here. Alcatara on the car. You see, it's still in shit mode. We can't get into the radio. It's just off the truck. 2022, baby. Don't mean we still, that doesn't mean we still can't look at it. I guess these, uh, that's a traction control right there. This is like your, uh, 
illuminated light, you wanna, uh, you know, turn your brightness up in your, uh, your night set, uh, night right there. That is your trunk uh, right there. Open your trunk, spark, parking brake, of course. Paddle shifters on the car. I wonder, I wonder if we got a kick to a uh, up and down shift, of course. Dash and the steering wheel is beautiful. Beautiful. Climb, this will be your climate control right here. Look at this. Everything is screened. I don't remember if the GV80 looked like this. The, the, the GV70 looks better to me, like, if you, in my opinion. I like how everything is on this side. Like, everything is just on this side. Yeah, everything is just on this side. They go that design again right there. Look at that going across. Oh, right there. That is beautiful. That is uh, your style for the uh, the turn style for the, uh, your gears, trip the gears. This is a mouse pad for, uh, for the infotainment system. Check my other videos out if you don't know what I'm talking about. When you're driving, you could just... You know, switch all instead of reaching all the way up there. That is like I think 11 point. That is 11 inch infotainment system. Push start button right there. I don't know what this is right here, but gorgeous, gorgeous. You know USB C, USB port, cup holders. Of course, it's getting to here. No USB C. 2022. No USB C. Come on now. What is that? Oh, another 12 volt cigarette lighter, right there. That would be a drive mode. Of course, over here. Navigation, map, hazards, radio, media, setup. I wish I could show it, but like I said, it is in ship mode. So we're just going to do a small walk around, exterior, interior. Let's get over to that passenger side. Passenger side of the car, same thing. Um, there's the driver's side. You got your, this design going across right here. I'm going, I don't know what to call that. I really don't, but Lexicon speaker right there. Cup holders, of course. Genesis on the mass Alcatara seats. The Alcatara seats is that that's for me right there. I love Alcatara. Any car that I get, it has to have Alcatara. And let's talk about the roof since we're talking about Alcatara. Alcatara on the roof, panoramic sunroof, of course. It is Alcatara on the roof. That's the best, that's the best you can get. You ask me, no matter what color it is, it could be peanut butter, white, Alcatara, black. <laughs> It has to be Aquatory. That's the best you can get it, of course. Let's get it in on this side. Ugh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that driver's side. Look at look at that over there. That infotainment is now. I wish we can get it started so I could see it. For real, for real. But you know, cut photos over here. Close that up. Open that back up. Hmm. Hmm. Dark compartment, nothing in there, your manual and all that. But on this side, it looks very nice. Infotainment is slightly tilted that way everything is on the side a lot of cars starting to put everything on the driver's side as they should as they should let's get up out of here real quick Ugh. is it no memory seats but it is uh control your seat control over here you want to move it up move it backward and it is another setting over here right there move that up move that back move that up move that back but I guess that'd be, I guess that's like easier for the driver. I don't know. I don't know what that's, I don't know why they put that there, but let's get on to that back seat. Back seat of the car, of course. You see it right there. You got your lead in for the block of the sun now, in case you got your babies in the back. It says a family car, by the way. Don't get it twisted. But it's that, this design, I can't stop. I can't get off this design. I don't know what that is with the car. That, that is gorgeous. Just look at that. But Genesis right there, aluminum, not illuminated, baby. Aquatara back here, of course, still. You got your net in right here. The back seat is getting here. Whew. Panoramic sunroof comes all the way to the back, of course. Most cars don't bring it all the way back, but it comes to the back. This Aquatara feels amazing. Leather in the middle, leather uh, for the cup holders. Wish that was Aquatara, but it can't be all Aquatara, I guess. Climate control back here, heated seats, of course. Both sides, climate control back here. No USB C. Got a plug out there though. That's a nice touch. I, I like that for cars. No USB C. Everything is USB C now, Genesis. Come on, man. You got to get with it. But it is. I get it. Uh, dome lights back here. Look at that. Look how I fade on and it fade off. Fade on, fade off. I'm going to show you one in the front too as well. But yeah, that design. I can't stop looking at that. Get back up there. Uh, uh, zoom it back out. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. This back seat is very comfortable. It's very spacious. For your kids, you know, this is a, a nice family SUV, mid-size SUV. GV80 is bigger, but the GV70 is, it's, this is, this is perfect. This is the perfect size. Look at that. Look at that infotainment system right there. Just look at the interior of this. Look at this. More Akatara on the side. Like, look at that. 
Oh, that's that's the best for me. That is that's that's just it don't get no it don't get no better than that. No better than that. Oh my goodness. Let's get to that trunk space though. Mm. Trunk of the car. Let's see what's back here. You got the Genesis right there, of course. First day premium premium first day kit back here. Does it come with a spare tire? Mm. Probably not. I'm not gonna lift out all of that up because this is I don't wanna touch nothing. I don't wanna touch nothing that I ain't got no business touching. But yeah, you got some netting over there, of course. No interior oh interior lights back here. LED, of course, everything has to be LED, like I always say in my videos, baby. But when I say press, don't pull. Push, don't pull, baby. Come on now. Wish we had the key because it is hot in this car. But I understand because it's just off the truck. It just got here. But you get what you get when you do when you're doing this type of stuff. You get what you get. Now you're gonna get the best of the best right now. I ain't I ain't at the top yet. I ain't at the top just yet. We're gonna get there though. We talk about my overall opinion on this Genesis GV70. I feel this is better than the GV80. It reminds me of the Bentley Bentayga. The GV the, the GV80 is bigger. I don't know. I don't know. The interior, okay. Let's say the interior of the GV70 is better than the GV80. But the exterior of the GV80 is better than the GV70. Because it's, it's more big, bigger. They both remind me of a Bentley Bentayga with that big grill in the back end. But the Genesis got its own look with that. The light design, the dual lights and all that. But for the price of this, it's, it's very worth it. Once you, I wish I could show you everything. If it wasn't a shipping bar, I got to keep saying that. But if it wasn't a shipping bar, I wish I could show you everything. For the price of this, it's, I'm pretty sure it's, it's very worth it. But if you're a Genesis fan, it's, it's for sure worth it. If you're not a Genesis fan, you know, of course you're going to feel like you can get better out there because you got Grand Cherokee fans, you got... I don't know, Escalade, Lincoln, like, the, this, it won't be the same, but SUV-wise, like, you, mm, you, get, you get what I'm saying. But if you're looking for this particular model, I'm at Elder uh, Hyundai, Hyundai in Sterling Heights, Michigan. If you out of state, give them a call. They can ship it to you. I wish I could show you everything, go for a drive, but like I said, it is brand new. Brand new, 2022, just hit the lot. So, yeah, but if you're new to the channel, you made it to the end of my video, Thank you for your support. Help me grow. The, grow, the bigger we get, the better cars we're going to get. Like, the, the bigger they, you feel me? They're going to they overlook you, then they go going to overbook you. So, I'm getting overlooked right now because I'm new to this, but it ain't going to stop me. But watch all my videos. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. And I'm out.